Welcome back to the channel. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to bridge your safe moon tokens and turn it into the P safe moon tokens. So you're able to use your safe moon on the Ethereum network. Now it's actually quite easy to do this. Should only take about five minutes. I'd like to just let you guys know as well before we get started, I do have daily cryptocurrency tutorials on this channel, showing you guys how to sell, how to buy, and lots more within the crypto space. So if you guys are interested in safe moon and in crypto, I'd really recommend subscribing to this channel as I have tutorials coming out long into the future. Anyhow, how to bridge your SafeMoon token, all you have to do is come over to SafeMoon's Twitter right here, and I'll have a link in the description and in the comment section for this Twitter right here, where we're going to get the contact address for the P SafeMoon token. So we can just go down to this link right here where they have uh, this tweet right here, and we sort of copy this contact address. Once we have this contact address, this is what we're going to need for the P SafeMoon token later on in the tutorial, so you can just know where to access this. Uh, anyhow, I'm going to have the next link in the description. It's going to be over to the ptokens.io website, which is just right here. And this is where we're going to swap our safe moon into the P safe moon token. Now, there's a couple things you guys need before we get started here. You do have to have a MetaMask wallet. Uh, so that is what I recommend using. It's a lot easier when you're doing this kind of stuff with Ethereum, uh, just because it is, does work the best. Uh, now, if you guys don't know how to make a MetaMask wallet, I will have a link in the description for a tutorial on how to create your MetaMask wallet as well, if you guys need that. Uh, anyhow, what you have to do once you have your MetaMask wallet, uh, you have to click on this Connect Wallets button at the top right of the screen. Once you click on that, you want to go to where it says the Ethereum network and just click on connect. And you want to connect it to your MetaMask. You'll know it's connected when you go back over to the wallets. And then you see the Ethereum address right here. And it just says change. So you know that's connected to your MetaMask. Now what we can do is go over to where it says smart chain. And you want to click on connect for that as well. Then you want to click on wallet connect. What this is going to do is going to pop up this QR code that we have to scan with, a, say, our Trust Wallet or a MetaMask Wallet if we have that on our phone as well. But I know a lot of people do use Trust Wallet for SafeMoon as it is right now. So I'm going to show you guys how to connect this portion to your SafeMoon so we could use our SafeMoon balance in our Trust Wallets and then turn it into P SafeMoon and then it'll go over to our MetaMask Wallet. So what we're going to have to do here now is go over to our phones where we have our Trust Wallet and open that up. So I'll show you guys really quickly what my screen looks like. So once we're on our phone right here, we want to go over to our Trust Wallet and open that up. Once we're on our Trust Wallet here, we want to go over to the settings in the bottom right corner, click on that, then just click on Wallet Connect. Once you click on Wallet Connect, it'll open up this camera, and then it will scan that code on your screen. And it'll just take a second for it to connect here, and it's going to ask us for permission to connect to the Ptokens website, in which case we want to click on Connect. And once we do that, it'll say go back to our browser, and we'll be connected fully right here. Now what we want to do is we want to search at the top here for From, and we want to find our SafeMoon token. So we just go ahead and type in SafeMoon. Once we see that, we can go ahead and click on the safe moon token right here. And then you'll see our safe moon token up right here. And another P safe moon token will come below it for us right here. Now there is a minimum that we can transfer. It is 10 million. So you guys have to make sure you're at least transferring 10 million into P safe moon or else it will not let you do that. And just lets you know that right here, the minimum swap amount at the bottom of the screen. So let's just say, for example, we're going to do 10 million. We can go ahead and type the 10 million right here. Just like this. And then what we have to do is go ahead and click on swap. Once we click on swap, there'll be another notification on our phones. So that'll just pop up on our phone right here, just asking us to confirm the transaction. So you just want to go ahead and click on send for this. Once you guys click on send, it'll then start the transaction and then your PSafeMoon will then go into your MetaMask wallets. Now, if you guys, for whatever reason, don't see the PSafeMoon in your MetaMask wallet, all you have to do is go over to the extensions on your Chrome, open up your MetaMask wallet. And once you're in your MetaMask wallet, all you have to do is go over to add a new token. So you want to click on add token and then custom token. And then we can go ahead over to the SafeMoon Twitter, copy this contact address, come back over into our MetaMask wallets, and then go ahead and paste that in. So I'll show you guys really quickly what I mean. So we just go back to add token, custom tokens, and then go ahead and paste that address in here. It will then load up P SafeMoon for us and the token decimals. So we can just go ahead and click on next. And then your P SafeMoon will then come up in here. And then we can click on add and then you'll see your P safe moon is now added to your wallet. So once you guys have that token and you complete this transaction, your P safe moon will then appear in your MetaMask wallet available for you to use on the Ethereum network. Anyhow, I really hope I was able to help you guys out with showing you guys how to bridge your safe moon and transfer it over into the P safe moon token. If this video does help you out. Be sure to leave a like on the video and subscribe for more content. Thanks for watching.